We're going to take a sample here. I know there's a difference between taking a bulk density sample versus a sample for description. Can you explain to me what I need to do here? Okay, well, what you're going to do is you're going to use this shovel, square-headed shovel that has a sharp um, edge here. Mm -hmm. And this shovel has a certain dimension, which you measured how much? It's 17 centimeters okay, across. Okay, so 17 centimeters across. So you're literally going to take it and put it into the ground and, and dig out a square, 17 by 17 centimeters, mm -hmm. down to into the mineral soil. Okay. So you want to go ahead and try to do that? Yeah. Good, okay. Get that square cut out. All right, I've got the sample. What do I do next? Well, um, with this sample, we can do two main things. Uh, we can take this sample as it is, put it in a container and take it back to the lab for a complete description of the forest floor and what humus form we have here, because we've got L, we've got some F and we have AH. Mm -hmm. That's one thing. The second thing we could do is a, a similar sample to this. We could take off the mineral soil from below and have the uh, organic at the surface here. And um, we, could, we know that we've got the area, so it was 17 by 17 centimeters. We measure the depth of the forest floor, so that will give us a volume of forest floor. We take just the forest floor, remove all the mineral soil, and take that back to the lab, put it in an oven overnight, and uh, dry it, oven dry it. And then we have the uh, weight of the soil. The weight over the volume will give us the density and then we know what the density is of that soil. And that's a very important soil property to, to measure. Now for organic soils, you might wonder what we would use that for, the bulk density. It can be used to convert, um, if we take the concentration of carbon in here or any other nutrient, we can use the bulk density measure to convert that to amount of carbon or amount of nutrients over a larger area. Okay. So it's, it's very helpful in that manner. Mm -hmm.